right, so see this store behind me right here? A lot of y'all that have been around for a long time know I'm a crazy flashlight nut. And I've, I've never done a video about any of my lights, really in-depth video about my lights or anything like that. So several years ago, I run across this place right here. It's in Smyrna, Georgia. It's called Going Gear. It was actually uh, founded by Marshall Hoots, who has now passed away and uh another group has it now but this is where i buy all of my flashlights or most all of my flashlights is right here so i'm gonna take y'all in here i happened to find marshall on youtube years ago several years ago and i first came over here right after he opened this store at this location he had it at a different location first off and so i'm gonna take y'all inside if you like flashlights this is the place to come right here so y'all hang tight So if y'all like lights, here you go. <laughs> and this is not all of them that they got. They've got a bunch of them in the back back here also too. Like I said, it's called going gear. But if you're in the knives too, knives or any kind of EDC, everyday carry stuff, they have it over here. So I drove over here today and this is the last free weekend i have before hunting season opens up and i just wanted to share all this with uh with y'all they have all kinds of knives they have the bench made and they have the southern grind right here which is made uh, uh just south of here a little ways they have all of them they have some climbing gear they got uh hatchets and stuff like that over there too we got boker uh crkts i got them but what is so cool uh, run across marshall on youtube he did youtube videos on flashlights and uh that's how I got on. If you're into camping and hiking, they have a lot of that stuff too. And bags, they got tons of bags. I'm going to show y'all some of the stuff that I've got. I have a lot of this Maxpedition stuff. You could drag it down the road behind a truck and you're not going to hurt it. It's bad to the bone. But the only problem is, is it's heavy. It's a little bit heavy, but it's durable. If you like headlamps, they got them. They got some, I'm going to show you some tough headlamps here in just a little bit. All kind of fire starting stuff. And so they're online. I'm not getting anything for this. I just wanted to share this with y'all because it's a cool place. They got a lot of stuff. They got an incredible website that is just loaded to the gills with stuff. They ship everything right here from this store right here. See, this is where they ship everything from is back there and they have a bunch of stuff back there in the back back here that they don't have on the shelves that uh, you can ask them about and I'm going to show you some of that here in just a little bit. Got your sleeping pads, sleeping bags. They carry the right and the rain stuff. Please. 
We got lots of Eno stuff too. So he's fixing to pull out a new light. This is a customer in here that just bought a light right here. It's a Prometheus Beta QRV2. Mm -hmm. so Y'all sell a lot of lights out of here, right? Yeah. <laughs> We're going to talk to you here in just a second. So Does it take a take a triple A? Is that what it's a triple A? Triple A battery. Um, I think it's eighty five or ninety lumens. Uh, a perfect little keychain yeah. keychain light. Exactly. This this is a quick release. So you can pull it off your keychain when you need to. Okay. It's so in a sealed bag because it's all brass and it will tarnish. Tarnish, yeah. It's got the air sealed out of it. That's the way that I bought that O light, the small one that's similar to that right there in the copper. Yeah. And it came like that, you know. Yeah, it's got a bit of a heft to it. Yeah, I like the I like the heavier feel on that right there. That's pretty cool, man. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Jason really yeah. So they got They got uh Leatherman stuff. Yeah, I got some Swiss Army stuff right here. Yes. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Alright, so here we go. Alright. <laughs> this is a normal size AA battery right here. One and a half volts. <laughs> normal stuff. So most of all of my lights that I have run this battery right here. This is a what they call it's an 18650. 3.7 volts you can get these in different uh milliamp hours the olight i think i got some don't they make them up to like 3400 yeah, yeah. 3600 3, now okay that's what most of my lights take the longer the milliamp hour the longer it'll run too and then i have some of my small lights that run a battery similar to this there's my baton my olight baton right there and uh it runs a cr123 which is it's a little bit shorter than this battery. But the cool thing is, is all these batteries are rechargeable. All right, so we're gonna go up one size larger than the 18650. He's pulling it out now. This is the 21700 is what this is. Look at the size of that joker right there. It's a little bit longer, larger diameter, 5100. This is 5000. These lights right here have 5100 milliamp hour in them. So this is what I always say in my videos. This is sticker pecking out stuff, boys, is what this is. So these, what I'm going to do, I'm going to buy these three lights right here. And uh, these are normal uh, Cree style lights, what we've been running for, for years of the LED stuff. But they run on the 21700s. You can charge them in the lights which all of my other lights with the 18650, I had to pull them out and put them in a charger to charge them. So we're gonna step up in power to the 21700. Now, y'all know that I'm affiliated with uh, Milwaukee Tools. All their six, uh, XC battery packs carry this battery in them now, and it's very, very stout. So this light right here is a 4,000 lumen light. This is a headlamp right here. It's a 4,000, it's an ace beam. Both of these are ace beam and this is an ace beam also too, but we're going to get in this one here in just a second. We're going, I got somebody here that's going to talk about it, but uh, these are, uh, I like the smaller style. Would you, you grab, open that thing, pull that thing out for me right quick, right there. And uh, we'll get it out and show you the size of this one right here. So this is the size of this light. Right here, this is just going to be a carry light that I'll carry with me hunting. And then the, the headlamp is just a, it's just a small light too. There we go. I can see you've been playing with the knives a little yeah, bit. Yeah, and got your, you, this headlamp right here, it's got the regular normal light and it's got a red light on it. And then it's also got a UV light on it too, which is, is pretty doggone cool. Okay. I'm messing you up, man. Sorry. No, no like go ahead. I, you can do it. It's, it's all good. All right. All right. So tell us about the new style light right here. So is that has an LEP versus an LED? Which so is, it's not, we're out of the LED stuff now. We're in LEP. That's right. LEP is what we're in. Yes. Now. And there's people that can talk much more intelligently about it than I can. Yeah, but, but you all we got right now, yeah, dog. I, know, I mean, I know. you go, you're gonna have to run with it right here. Just kind of hit the high spots on it. What it is? This is, this thing does not have no Cree LED in it at all. It's, it does not. So it's a, 
and I might misspeak here, but it's a laser excited phosphor or something like that. But basically it's got several hundred times the density of an LEP. <laughs> um, and it, it unscrew the filter on it right there. Take unscrew that and take that off right there. Basically guys in country boy terms, redneck terms, <laughs> this freaking light right here will shoot two miles and you can see it doesn't have anything in the center of it right there. I mean, it is just, say it just blacked the camera, just killed the camera right there. But I'm gonna get this, I'm gonna buy this. It comes with uh, with a red filter and a green filter that screws into it right there. And you can charge the battery into the light. So this will be my next level up. It runs on a 21700 too. So I just busted up in here today and come in here and told him a little bit of my history and things like that. And, and I'd actually communicated with Marshall a good bit and talked to Marshall here at the store a lot too and everything. And it was actually before I got on YouTube wow, and sure. stuff because I started the YouTube in 2014. So that was prior to that. And uh, so this is going to be plowing new ground for me right here. And this is also an ace beam light too. So, uh, but I told him what I was doing and I told him I wanted to shoot a video in here. So he said, knock yourself out, man. So here we go. What's your name? Daniel. Man? Daniel. Appreciate it, Daniel. Yes, sir. So we got to do this right here, y'all. This gentleman just bought this this knife right here. <laughs> and what, what, you, what was this right here? It's now? a Cobra Tech. Cobra Tech. Cool. So there you go. Uh, it's going to be neat to play with the new light LEP technology and see how it works. It's any good or not. We'll check it out and we'll see. Uh, so, like I said, they didn't give me anything or nothing like that. I really like Marshall. Uh, could come over here and talk to him. Very, very cool individual. Uh, they have a lot of videos on YouTube, Going Gear does, and you can look at Marshall's older stuff and everything like that. He did phenomenal flashlight reviews on on uh, Going Gear on the YouTube channel. Just uh, very, very in-depth stuff and things like that. But just a cool store. If you're in the area, this is right here in Smyrna, Georgia. If you're in the area, swing by here check it out it's an easy day drive for me over here and back it's about three hours and 50 minutes to right here from my house and uh so i just took y'all on a little tour in there man i like sharing things that that work for me and stuff like that and the cool thing about it is that wall of lights in there they all got batteries in them so you can sit there and you can play with all those lights turn them on and off and all that stuff like that and and they got them situated where they start from the smallest lights to the largest lights and uh just very cool and then they got tons more stuff in the back that's not on the shelf so uh appreciate y'all watching hope y'all enjoy your sunday and uh you can uh check out everything down below i'll have an affiliate link with because they gave me one the end of the day while i was in here they asked me if i'd done stuff like that and i said sure i did so i'll have me an affiliate link to them and y'all can click through me to get to them and then i'll get a little cut out of the sale and stuff like that same way the amazon stuff works so Everything clickable is right down below. Remember my website if you want some Cotton Top 3 merchandise, cottontop3.com. Clickable link right down there below too. Check it out. So uh, if you have any questions or anything like that, you can ask them down below. If I know the answer, I'll answer them. So uh, we'll catch y'all later. Later, taters.